Hello ladies and gents, this is Kano from the Gamer Section back with another review. For today's review is on Dredge for the Xbox Series X and S, Xbox One, PlayStation 4 and 5, Nintendo Switch and PC. The music in the game is kind of sad when you dock in the game. When you are on the ocean, the music is soothing. But at night, because of the horror aspects of it, it does tend to give you that spooky feeling. When it comes down to the audio from the sounds of the sea to the dialogues, it is good. The graphics in the game is not the best in the world, but because of the cartoonish paint style of Dredge, it is decent. The whole movement is fast and fluid from the menu to the whole settings in the game. Dredge is a fishing adventure game where you go around to catch fish and some other things. Dredge also have that RPG elements in the game to upgrade your boat and also get other abilities like haste to speed up your boat and other things. Other collectibles in the game including different relics, woods, material things to help with the upgrades. There are side missions so it will feel more like an open world RPG style game. At night, if you are still fishing, it becomes more so in a horror style game based off the fact that you will panic in the game along with finding weird looking fish. Some of the fish that you do find at night will get you more money in the game. The biggest thing in Dredge at night is when you panic at night, you will run into things that you never knew was there. And not only that, if you don't upgrade your boat, you will easily break your boat down to the point you will need massive upgrades. When fishing in the game, it does feel like a mini game from collecting fish to, collect, to collecting relics in the game, along with debris. I honestly felt this game was kind of boring doing some of the most repetitive things in the game including just fishing going back and forth along with collecting the relics in the game. When it comes to the storyline in the game, you pay your debt that you owe, but what else is there in the game that makes you excited to keep playing? The game honestly kept me not wanting to play for the second ending in the game after beating it for the first time. There is some complex aspects to the game when you upgrade the boat and fishing that makes it not that exciting in the game. For that, I give Dredge a 3 out of 5. Thank you for tuning in to the best place for gaming and that's the gamer section. Be sure to hit the like button on the video and please subscribe to the channel.